Love itself is what's left over when being in love has burned away. And this is both an art and a fortunate accident. We have roots that grow towards each other underground. And when all the pretty blossom had fallen from our branches, we found that we were one tree and not two. But for so many years, I wondered who God had in store for Lindsay, but he never did. <laughs> he knew it all along. Um, when Jordan came into your life, I saw a side of you I had never seen before. I was watching this new guy pursue you so fiercely. He has always had eyes for you. And I was impressed not only by his height, but by his heart. <laughs> he had his heart set on you from the moment he met you. I've seen God work in you two so much, and I'm just really grateful to be part of it. Jordan, also known as Jord J. Jorge. <laughs> I've called you countless nicknames over the years, but today I get the amazing opportunity to call you my new personal favorite. My husband. Don't let go, just keep your heart. Jordan, I'll never forget the day I met you. This tall, determined guy in a plaid button-up walks up to tell me I needed to stop leading on his friends. <laughs> <laughs> Not the smoothest of moments, but one that I'm forever grateful for. I mean, who knew the guy sitting in front of me that night would soon be a face I would be waking up to every day for the rest of my life. I really struggle to write this stuff down. I've been thinking about this for weeks. What I want more than anything is just for you to feel worthy and loved. Because I know you struggle with feeling worthy and I've never met somebody who's more worthy of love than you. The fact that we've probably been in the same room countless times growing up but never met until that night says something. It means God's timing is perfect. But that's been our story all along, hasn't it? It's meant patience, it's meant devotion, it's meant choosing to love one another when it was hard to love ourselves. things that are going to happen. Mm -hmm. I will always remind you how worthy you are. You've consistently reminded me of my worth and my identity in Christ. <laughs> I can't ask for a better love than that. You've pursued me and you've made me a better human. Your fierce love points me to the cross and shines a light on even the cloudiest of things. Jordan, I promise to return this gift back to you for the rest of my life. We've been through a lot. The most important thing is that we made a decision that we wanted to be together and we were gonna to commit to each other. Mm -hmm. And so I commit to you today that I'm not always going to be perfect. But I promise that I'm going to work out every day. And every day I want to make you feel loved and worthy and that I'm not going anywhere. I promise to always be here forever, you and me. God has already written my favorite love story and it's only just begun. I love you, Jordan. And you also. <laughs> Don't give up on my love